and welcome. And <laughs> welcome to the Max and Wade show. I think we had a minor earthquake there for a second. Uh, I don't I don't know what happened. We. Me, 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 me. You went flying. <laughs> All right. So, and I'm your host, Wade Post, and your other host. And your other host is here, Max Matos. You know, the the better one. That's putting it not lightly. I I don't know where I was going with that. Anyway! So, what you been up to? What's, what's happening since you've uh, been crippled by a uh, good old way post here because he's just so good at basketball uh, that he crippled you? So, what, what, what happened there? What? Because you're crippled <laughs> for basketball. Wade Post crippled you, huh? Oh, me? <laughs> you crippled me? There you go. <laughs> yeah. But that's totally what happened. I'm Wade Post, and I crippled Max <laughs> Matos. Woo! I'm afraid of the man of the man! Oh, yeah. Anyways, look at that sexy beast. I know that was before we got our <laughs> new jerseys. I used to be 22, and now, yeah, but I'm mm. 55. It just Wait. makes you wanna. Mm. Now I'm 55. Wait a second. Now, oh, yeah, bro, but no, not them. 55, and this is for a wigging. Bro, was just that guy, bro, bro. Don't put that on. <laughs> Let me flip it around. Oh my Here's, gosh, it's reversible. Here's the black version. What? <laughs> that's that's the away color. No, this is the home color. This is the black. You, you guys have black for home? Yeah. I've never seen a team that's black at home. And red is away. Well, we had to do that now because I've never seen Murray County Central. And I have basketball shorts. Yeah. Now, well, I'm no Steph Curry or uh, LeBron James, uh, but <laughs> I back. <laughs> shut up. We can't. Okay, uh, we're keeping it moving. Um, I did Boom land myself game. <laughs> in the seventh grade game. Uh, we played Brown Lake Rooster. And, uh... Mountain Lake? Wait, no, not Mountain Lake. I'm trying to make up a fake name. <laughs> um, John Cena... You said Mountain Lake! No. You could just say it. You just I say didn't it. say Mountain Lake. Uh, <laughs> John Cena area Maxville. No! What? <laughs> okay, whatever. We played... LCD. Old. You you already said it, so it's it's no. Not, I, okay, it's, just, all right. Brown Lake a... Rooster. Okay, they in junior high basketball have been known to not be as good as a team. They're a good team. As good, allegedly. I'll bring you to first quarter. Well, pregame. Uh, you know, I'm just dunking. You know, as I do every every day on the court. I, I really do like <clears throat> I really do like the seventh grade warm ups. I really do like seventh grade warm ups, but I yeah, I'm in eighth grade. It's the one time wait, hold on. Any guys anyway guys, I wanna okay. I want us to I'm um, continuing on. Hold on. Dang, man. I'm trying to do a sponsor. How did I got sidetracked and I'm in the middle of my story. I was, you know, going around. We have really good. Visions. And this coach. Oh, get a beat. <laughs> we're with the seventh grade coach. Shut up, Max. We're with the seventh grade coach. And he keeps us on rotation, man. It's just, boop, okay, you're out. Boop, okay, you're in. Boop, okay, you're out. Boop, okay, you're in. And, Shoving um, in it. Well, I know, but, like, he put the whole bench out. And everybody in, like, rot- the rotation. starters. 
Yep. Uh <laughs> <laughs> so basically this first quarter we went by I think we were winning maybe by ten. Uh and then we get to the second quarter. We are staying. I mean, it's a close game. All the way up until the second quarter. We had two overtimes. So that's like four minutes of full playing. Uh, but in the end, they scored twice and lost. Uh, I really wanted to score, and I didn't. I I know Max just raised his eyebrows at me, but I'm going to get over it. But Because I was like, okay, Wade, you're going to score. It's a seventh grade game. You're in eighth grade. You're going to score. You're going to be Steph Curry and LeBron James. Uh... <laughs> bro, bro has that Nicole Jokic build. Anyway, if if you know, you know. <laughs> so that was Monday. Thursday, we played Johnston County Area School District. Johnston Area School District. No, then that's okay. Johnston County Schools. We played them, and you know these are all made up. So like, just yeah. Well, they're not made up. They're real, but they're based on true story. Um, yeah, we beat them, and I got in quite a bit tonight. And I want to say I had two free throws, but I did not make them. And so now I'm just like, and that was an hour. And I how many points did you end with? Fired up, huh? How many points did you end with? A hundred. I know. I'm. I'm really. Well, was well. Well, was that guy? But uh, I did, I want to say I made an assist. So, uh, you know, and I feel like this is okay to name drop, but, like, I'm just going to say this person passed me, and then I passed it back to them by the, ah, I, I, I ah, everything was, like, the heat of the moment there. So it's try, I'm trying really hard to go back to that. But uh, we passed back basically an assist. So I got an assist. And then, okay, I got to act it out for you. So here, okay, my finger is the guy, okay? And I am the guy. I, I'm, <laughs> I'm me. So here's my teammate. And he's got the ball. And he's running down. And I just go, boom! <laughs> I just go, boom! <laughs> well, I think it was kind of, it was more of a, Right into his neck, like, <laughs> <laughs> like, like I went, like he ran, and then like, okay, this is his neck, okay, this is my arm. What's like, wrong oh. with you? What are you doing on that game? <laughs> so, this is my arm, okay. This is ne his neck. Oh, <laughs> and I was like, walk it off. You're fine. <laughs> But I did get a foul call. Well, yeah, I got a foul call. But I make a foul like every year, so it's like nothing new. But yeah, I, I like personally, I can't wait until um, you know, obviously, I'm I'm back in Minnesota. Um, you know, this year, obviously, I I can't play basketball. Um, but I know um in the rule book, I was looking at it. Um, for homeschool, I I can't I could do um extra. Dang, why can't <laughs> you like like extra, extra curricular class. activities? There we go. Thank thank you, Wade, Mister Dictionary. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, but thank you thank you. For that. Yeah. My but, grade. um. Sorry sorry. Continue. <laughs> but. You know, yeah, next year um I am gonna play so I'm I'm excited about that. Um I I'm probably gonna run like just at people. I I'm probably just gonna get the most malicious hard fouls. I'll be right back. Anyways, guys, I would love to mention our sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. I can't thank them enough. Just kidding, Raid Shadow Legends. That's out of here. Now we have NordVPN. 
Thank you for for <laughs> well, what yeah, the heck is that? <laughs> okay, I'll do is that. Is that what I think it is on the <laughs> ball? Why is it brown? <laughs> what is that ball, bro? <laughs> Shut up. We're gonna do a pretend advertisement. That or, is a ball, know. man. That feels so bad. The following advertisement has not been paid for by North Beacon. Okay, Too guys. Much. So when I go on the internet, I want to feel protected. I don't know what you do on the internet. And I don't want to know what you do on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I like to go to a coffee shop. I like to go to Tally Ho in Nutrition. Do you move? <laughs> you like I like to go to coffee shops and do homework after school. But with NordVPN, <laughs> when I connect to public internet, it gives me the protection I deserve and need. And you know that everyone needs some sort of protection sometimes. Yeah, and NordVPN. You know, I need protection, you need protection. Everyone can use some protection. <laughs> NordVPN.com. I mean, you, you, you're, I mean, your family should know about protection. Max, that's <laughs> weird. Go to NordVPN. Dot com yeah, because you know family itself. use NordVPN. Get 50% yeah, off your first year if you do annual subscription. 50% off, people. That's something. 50, guys. 50. Yeah, because my and family uses NordVPN. And I'm telling them. Yeah, I'm wait. Gonna and I'm going to post it. And they're going to watch it. And they're going to be like, oh, my God. Oh, cool. So. Yeah, and, you know. I, I use, you know, I, I have a whole lot of protection when I use NordVPN. Are you trying to spin that ball on your finger? No, no, no. I'm trying to show you guys. Okay. Here's the ball I write on. These are all our games. And then here is... Is like, that your schedule? Did you just write the schedule no, on a ball? No, Here's our January tournament. W's in all the games. Uh, And then you have this nice little red here. School colors, red and black. And then it fades down. I think, like, that's cool. The paint is still drying, but I really like it. I try to show that. It looks nice. Yep. It Anyways, is. guys, use code WADYPOSTY for 50% It's off the, the Max and Wade show, yeah. actually. No, okay. there's two codes. I, this is, like, my show and tell. Um, call me. It's a lot. Is that what I think it is? Wait, is that no 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 no? That looks so bad. The thing in the corner that looked like an event that I can't like we can't say on this podcast, but so, that looked like a specific event that that wait, um up. went on in American history. This is basically uh the nine one one of Chandler, except not a lot. Like one person got injured. Like this is like I'm not oh, I'm not trying yeah, to. Yeah, I I thought that that was like the. The the nine one one, you know. But yeah, like that day really kind of had me. Like I don't know, like I was upset, kind of. So it's like, okay, I'm gonna flip crazy. out paper clippings and be like, okay. So, basically, I am my own town historical society because I live in a small town. Look at that picture. Like yeah, look at that picture. Look at it over there. All I see is my gorgeous face. That's their little statement or whatever. Because ooh, what happened was a elevator exploded and went boom. And if you have Facebook, <laughs> scroll down a little bit and you'll see the elevator explosion. Because it was caught on camera when it exploded. And it's really cool. It wasn't by Wade though. Like we like we, we it wasn't by any of us. We can't it felt like it we gotta give credit where credit is due. Like people say for seven miles, and that's like pretty much the whole town. Well actually no. For seven miles, it was like an earth you could feel it. Like it was that bad. So yeah. And I think when I came home that night, I saw a glass that fell on the floor and shattered. I think. I don't I don't know. But, uh, yeah, I got it framed, so I almost dropped it. Whoops. That's nice. We should make I thought that that was like, an, I thought that that was like a, a certain event that we can't have on the podcast Um, that happened in American history. I thought yep. you framed that. Let's do our Florida moments. It's your... Let's go for it. All right. Florida... Wait. Okay. 
Florida man accused of using a hammer to kill two men in act of revenge. This was one day ago, posted by Fox 35 or Max. Well, <laughs> well, like, um, doing whatever you're doing to the camera. Okay. Here, wait. Okay, here's the mugshot. Boom. And they were all yellow. <laughs> <laughs> I I want your credit card. <laughs> His name. It's not even just gonna flee. <laughs> Hi, my <laughs> name is Jose. Tell you that guy. My name watch is Jose. How guy. are you doing, Max? This is what happened. Jose, with... like, watch out for this man. This man is dangerous. <laughs> okay, Jose. Quinterero, 29, was booked into jail over the weekend on multiple charges, including two counts of first-degree murder. Oh, but, okay. Um, we're just going to skip right over that. At 7 p.m. on sun Saturday, January 27th, deputies were called to a home on Tucker Avenue in Orlando regarding a man down. As deputies responded, a witness informed the dispatcher that killed people at the home tried to. Inside the residence, deputies found two men with severe head trauma. Yeah. So, uh, turns out not to be my little funny, happy Florida man, but that's what, uh, yeah. Um, <clears throat> Florida man accused of stealing, stealing over $100,000 from an armored truck at Circle K. So, he, uh, thought he got a payday, but, uh, like he didn't. This is posted by Click or Orlando dot com. Happened in Pasco County, Florida. A man was taken into custody last week after over a hundred and two thousand dollars was reported stolen from an armored truck at a Circle K gas station, according to the Pasco County Sheriff's Office. Deputies say that Stefan Cruz, thirty-seven, <clears throat> went to the gas station located around. State Road 52 in Hudson on January 3rd, parking his van next to the Guard World Armored Truck. <clears throat> and we bring it over to Max with the famous birthdays. And he's smirking right now. Yes. Wait. Okay. Oh, I have I have a Florida man. I have a Florida man. Uh, and this this is very important. Max doing the Florida man? Not clickbait. Okay. Yeah, <clears throat> not clickbait. What do you got for us? I'm gonna show. I'm gonna show the picture. You guys really need to be careful with this man. Okay? okay. Like this is this is this is like like really important. I really want you guys to be safe. Okay. Watch out for this man. Watch out for this man. <laughs> this man is dangerous. This man is a threat to society. If you see that, him, the, please call that YouTube thumbnail. That's the character. <laughs> right there. It wouldn't be long. <laughs> I wonder what Drew. I wonder what Drew that kid to do that guy. Kid, guy, dude. It's a, it's on YouTube. I know it's on YouTube. We'll look for the video. But anyways, let me mention my celebrity birthdays. Um, I'm gonna start from the bottom up. Um. So right we bottom. have, <laughs> okay, um, go ahead. of course, wait, you know, <laughs> well, we're still at the bottom. Anyways, <laughs> you're um... still at the bottom. I'm, at the top, <laughs> I'm waiting for you to rise to the top, but you're not coming. Go ahead. <laughs> we have Ronda Rousey. Um, there's a lot of um, like YouTubers and like TikTok do, do people, like but I'm, I'm not going to mention them. Memorable. There's, there's, there's no one, there's no one here that's memorable. Okay. Um, just who do you damn. think is the most famous? I, there's no none of these people are famous. Um, I'm just gonna go to the top because there's Stormy Wester, the son of I think it's oh, like Travis Stormy Scott. Kardashian. I mean the daughter. Wait, oh. Okay. No, it's Stormy Webster. Who? What? <laughs> that's nothing. That's the kid of Travis Scott. Oh. You don't know who that is? 
How do you just watch the Kardashians a little bit? Don't, don't, don't. What's wrong uh, with you for watching don't, the Kardashians? Don't, don't, don't come at me. I'm going to do the. I'm bro, gonna do bro the, just wanted to see Kanye West. Stormy, baby. Wake up. <laughs> That's my Kim K impression of waking up for time. Anyways, we're not going to ignore that. Um, <laughs> and at number one, you know, Harry Styles. So. What the fuck are you? That's. That's it. Oh, I do have to mention um, in entertainment, we had today um, premiered in 2012 um, My 600 Pound Life um, that aired in 2012 on this day. Um, so that I can't I can't say that. Oh, oh um, actually, OK, um, carry on. Um, yeah. And that that's it. Everything else is like um It's it's that is that Dr. Dre? It says I need a doctor and it has a picture of Dr. Dre. It's oh. not even a movie. Sponsored. It just has Dr. Dre. Sponsored by Gatorade. Oh my god. Wait. What's their slogan again? Sponsored by Clutch of Clans. <laughs> Sponsored by Gatorade. Drink fresh. What <laughs> drink you like that? It's like, oh my gosh. You're so. It's like in movies where you're they. You're so zesty. Like, it's like in movies where they so obviously. Well, die what movies do you watch that he drinks water like that? Gatorade is your number one sports drink since 1990. Okay. Carry on. Are you done? Wait. 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 There's something. There's something that I need to show you guys that this is really important. Okay? Don't this isn't funny. Okay. Don't laugh, Wade. Oh. This, this isn't funny. Okay? Okay, well while he's doing that. So if you No 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 no. I have it. And you real and you need to be careful with this dude. Oh my god, I bet it's the okay. same dude as well. Oh my god, we're running out of time, man! Okay, watch out for this man. <laughs> Who is that? <laughs> That's me! <laughs> Why do you have a picture of me eating cereal? That's ice cream. <laughs> oh! Oh, you gotta quit, man. You gotta. Ew, ew, ew. Okay, I'm gonna turn you think this right is now. Funny? You think that this is funny? Huh? You thought that that was funny? No, no I was eating ice cream, cream, man. <laughs> okay, so. I you think that this is funny? That's a dangerous man right there. He could come in your house. He could come right now. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I'm dangerous. Bro, like, like, okay. You call the law on me. Okay. I'm trying to find. Okay. Have you heard of the kill dozer? Of what? The kill dozer. What? Have you heard of the kill dozer? Grandpa. Grandpa Max. Okay. I don't know. No. I'll fill you in. So, <clears throat> it recently got more, you look like a torso with. Like no arms. Like, okay, so it recently has became popular again due to Whistling Diesel, a YouTuber, buying the same killdozer. Allegedly, he doesn't really say buying a killdozer, which is basically um, it's like a bulldozer that has like layers of steel around it, and it took down. This teeny town, um, not teeny, but it's like, it's like pipestone size, pretty much. And okay, quit trying to show off, you alpha male. Uh, but what's wrong? He tried to tear down this town of Grandy. Oh, oh, okay, it's in Colorado, 
and um, oh, oh, my God. okay, so oh, it's, it's not supposed to look like that. Oh my god, okay, let me finish my story. I'm gonna meet you. Uh, had very he had a rampage with this killdozer, and he had various garages against Grimby town officials, neighbors of his muffler shop, local press, and various other citizens of Granby. Over about 18 months, he Meyer secretly armored a Komatsu G3355A bulldozer with layers of steel and concrete. A soldier comes home. And so and once you get into this thing and shut it, you're not getting out. So he was like, mm. he was like, this is the end for me. Okay. I, I die. I died today. I think what his mindset was. But he takes his killdozer and he just starts taking down buildings in Grand, just like this happened on June fourth, two thousand four. It took two hours and seven minutes. Uh, yeah, and he allegedly wanted to live the American dream. He started down a path of just darkness and destruction. Marvin decided to modify the kill bulldozer he bought to construct the rejected road to a shop, thus birth the killdozer. Uh, so, yeah, the town allegedly planned to scrap it, uh, but that apparently didn't happen because this YouTuber bought it. And uh, he took shots by law enforcement, but no one died except him in this big old ramp. He went through the news building, the like the newspaper, um, and he got stopped at a hardware store because there was a basement, and that basement is filled in now. But he tore through the side of this basement, and then he like got lopsided because he didn't know there was a basement in there. So like he tore through, thinking it was flat ground, and then went like that. And so they tried to storm or something, but allegedly. Kind of sad, but he, you know, yeah. But yeah, that's the kill dozer. Uh, I'm gonna see if we can put like the kill dozer footage at the end of this video if you're watching on YouTube. Uh, but there's a news video of it where he um tore through. Uh, there's just yeah, I mean just lots of destruction, but nobody killed. But um. It, yeah, it was a whole thing. Wow. So, um, yeah. Wow. That was a whole big thing, allegedly. Yeah, but uh, got anything else, Max? Um, no, not really. Um, I just want to wish everyone a a good night or or day, you know, whenever you're watching this, you know, you know, um, my DMs are open. No, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, and I just Wade's DMs are open, obviously. I just received more information. <laughs> so, his name was Marvin Hemeyer, and it was seven million dollars worth of damage. And he did go through City Hall. So he ripped through City Hall. But they mm -hmm. were told to evacuate. So nobody was like, what, what is that? What is that? Is that a USB cord? But yeah. And then everybody, like, on the internet now is like, uh, okay, uh, we're gonna, like, like, they're like, my budget. Like, they're gonna be like, my plans. And it's a picture of the kill zone. And, um, my my budget and it's like a mini kill dozer, like a toy kill dozer. Uh and you know, I understand that the town wasn't very good to him, but he could have picked up and left. But he decided to take that town down, which is not okay. I mean yeah. But that is my take on it. I don't know what everybody else is thinking, but this YouTuber was like he had a lot of grudges, and it, you know, it was 
He didn't really say it was okay, but he said he might be just fine. Is he, though, for taking down a whole town and, like, so, like, I don't know. That's that's my take on it. Like, he could have picked up moved mm-hmm. to Denver because it's not far from there. Yeah. So, with that Anyways, night, guys, I think we're going to wrap this up for um, today. Um, I I really hope that everyone had um, a good listening. You know, we put a lot of um, blood, sweat, and tears. Um, mostly sweat um, and tears, especially hearing this dude. Um, anyway. <laughs> um, oh, but... my God, an explosion. <laughs> so, yeah. Help!